I'm Michaela and this is my April wrap up and May TBR. The next thing that I managed to finish in April is a Game of Thrones and I managed to finish the second half because I didn't quite get to finish it the month before. The next book that I finished is Labyrinth by Kate Moss and I did use the free trial on Audible with the audiobook for this which helped quite a lot and I do think I've got the review up for this already. If not, I'm not sure, I can't remember but I'll double check on that. And the next book that I managed to finish was New Moon by Stephanie Meyer and I don't know why I bought it but I know it was quite cheap and I'm surprised that I like this more than the first book because the first book was absolutely terrible and one of the only times where I, I said. The next book that I finished was by John Sweeney and this is Elephant Moon which is set in India during World War Two, and about the British leaving India and some of the young children in this having to go through a jungle with some elephants trying to escape. The next book that I managed to finish is A Shade of Doubt by Bella Forrest and yet again I absolutely loved the book and look forward to reading the next book next month when it finally gets released. And the, ne the next book that I've got I want to finish this month but the plan to finish soon in the next month and that is Dan Brown's The Lost Symbol and I think these thrillers are great if you don't like psychological things such as Gone Girl because they're a little bit easier to read than them and I'd recommend if you don't like those. As you already know I do plan to finish The Lost Symbol by Dan Brown and hopefully I'll enjoy this when I get through it all and the next book is a TBR jar pick and that is Midnight Over Santrafax is part of The Edge Chronicles by Paul Stewart and Chris Riddle and this is a great middle grade fantasy series that I think more than just middle grade age children would like if they struggle with high fantasy or aren't old enough to read that yet and I look forward to reading this because I love the series so far and the next pick was this and I'm not going to try and say the name because I will butcher it but I look forward to reading this and this shouldn't take long to read at all and the next book is The Shining Girls which I know is a thriller but I'm not going to try and say the surname because I'll butcher it and I don't know much about it so hopefully I like it and I do plan to read the next Shade of Vampire series like books in the series on my Kindle and I look forward to reading that too and the next book that I'm going to read isn't a TBR pick TBR jar pick and I'm going to read this The Miniaturist by Jessie Burton with Sophie and I'll link her channel below and without a push to read it as a buddy read with her I doubt I'll read it at all as it's been there for a couple, few months now and hopefully I'll manage to get through this and I hope you've enjoyed the video today and thanks for watching.